this said quit YouTube. Hey, Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your babe Bella Fresh. And yes, I know I've been gone for long and I just decided to do this video quickly. Because if I should if I don't do it right now, I'm going to keep procrastinating. Of course. <laughs> yes, it's my hobby again. You so actually he said I should quit YouTube. And that's exactly why. I've not been around. You said I should quit YouTube, I right? Did, babe. You said I should quit YouTube. Oh, let me ask you to take your time, babe. He asked me to quit YouTube. That's why that's I've been gone. True. That's not true. Babe, it's true. Stop that's lying. Why are you lying? Is it because the camera is here? That's not true. You said I should quit. You know you're lying. You said you didn't want me there anymore. That like, was stressing me out. Guys, I've not been. <sighs> YouTube has been stressful for me because the views are not forthcoming. So, probably said quit YouTube. You said quit, is it because they are watching? That's no, why I you're said like, take your time. Oh, you said I should quit, babe. No, babe you said so. You said I should quit. Between taking your time and quitting. Eh, yeah, so I took my time, but now I'm back on YouTube. December was challenging. <coughs> so many things happened towards the end of the year. Yeah. But thank God everything is fine. Um, oh, guys, the most important thing that uh, she's back and better. <laughs> yes, that's the most important thing. No need for long story. Exactly. So we celebrated the new year. Um, I'll insert clips now. You see Kingston and Kian celebrating with all the fire mm -hmm. crackers and all those things. Yeah. <laughs> Why are you running away? Come here. <laughs> I'm pitching some people. Yeah, so the new year started great. And this new year, I'm starting with a new motto. I have a new mantra, and it's a called. New motivation, guys. A new motivation. Uh -huh. <laughs> I'm starting with it. I have a new motto, and the title of my new motto is Happy Vibes. Because this year, that's always, all I want to transmit. Always, always. Like, so much happened, always. and I don't want to bring all those negative, sad vibes anymore exactly. to my channel. Yeah. It's just going to be happy vibes this year. Exactly. That's why I'm not going into details of nothing. So, a lot happened, but that's all gone. We're starting a new year. Um, yes, it's February. It's just going to be happy vibes all the way. Right. I'm, not gonna, I'm not going to let YouTube stress me this year. Like whatever will happen, let it be. Kiss her, kiss her, kiss her, yeah, kiss her, kiss her. Whatever will be, let it be. I'm not gonna quit. I'm just going to continue doing it till the algorithm remembers me one day. Babes, let's tell them about what happened with the Kian school. Currently, we've been quarantining. Yeah, exactly, guys. So we've been yeah. at home for all week, no movement. Because yeah. um, one of the teachers at Kian's crash. Kian, um, Kian and Kingston attend the same school. Yeah. So a teacher in, in the next class, next to Kian's class, actually caught COVID. Unfortunately. 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 We're just saying it just so that you guys know what's currently happening. So exactly. uh, we're supposed to be at home. It also affected Kingston. He couldn't go to school. Being the brother of one of mm -hmm. the students of that class. So we've all been home. And tomorrow we're going to take a COVID test. Yep. Yeah, so Kian, I'll be taking Kian to the hospital alongside his other classmates. So hopefully things will be fine. We feel okay. Fine. Yes, we have a bit of cold, but it's nothing COVID related. Mm. Nobody has had fever. Exactly. Nobody's coughing excessively. Mm. We are not having shortness of breath. Yeah, yeah. We just have like normal kata. I think it's because we've not been covering up well enough. Mm -hmm. I'm just feeling very woozy and or normal cold symptoms yeah so that's it guys we decided to do this video standing quickly because exactly. if we say if we should sit down we would not do this video man be possible <laughs> and that's like going to be a new thing on this channel we just you know we don't need to sit it's not necessary yeah, to sit down right now with kingston and Kian Kian, and it's harder and like my mom isn't living with us no, anymore easy. like back then when things were easier we could easily feel when mom she was around we miss her a lot, mommy. You know we miss you so. And it's not easy. She comes every twice a week to see us. It's not been easy for us. It's not been easy for me. That's one of the reasons why I've not been so motivated. Because when you see the views on YouTube, you'll be motivated to continue, even if you have so much on your hands. Even at a point in January, I started working, but because of COVID, I had to. Plus, we have to stay at home. So for now, I'm on break from work. As parents of two, two toddlers under two without help. Babes, my husband knows. I've asked him. I've told him so many times. Well, let me check his record. Was saying something? What was the last one? Let me check what I still recording. Babe, before that, we had to check that we're recording and not just talking nonsense and nothing was recording. So we had to quickly go go behind the camera to check. 
Um, yeah, but kids still can be now. Be now, I'm not going to school. Yeah, they're, they're at home and not going to school. In fact, at some point, I was almost falling into depression with the whole workload as a mom of this two. I was almost getting depressed. I told my husband, I want to go to Nigeria next week. Like, That's never an option. Yeah. And he's always told me it's not an option because I feel like if you live in Nigeria, it's very convenient for you because you can always get help with the kids but here it's almost impossible who wants to help you even if i decide to get a nanny i'm just going to be going to work for the nanny because nannies they earn close to over 50 euros a day yeah. and like in a month you're, you're spending about 1500 euros mm. thereabouts or more so if i even have money to save for myself it might be two or three hundred euros so i don't want to go work for any nanny I'd rather stay at home with them. So my career is on hold. So at some point I was like, babe, let me go to Nigeria and go and live my life. I had, there are so many hands willing to help. No. It's okay. not easy. Like no, an option. Okay. At a point I was so depressed and Hobby was like, it's not an option. He always wants his family next of to course, him. Of course, of course. He doesn't want us away. He doesn't like all that kind of family dynamics with one person. Kian is coming. <laughs> he doesn't like the family dynamic where husband is away and wife and kids are away from husband. Very convenient days. I know so many, it's worked for so many people, but he just feels it won't work nah, for us. I, sometimes I'm like, that distance, I need to be away from you for a while. Like, you understand? That kind of, you know, when you're married and you're like, to keep that fire between us burning, maybe distance might help it because, nah, you know, when, with, with all the stress of raising kids and everything we just find ourselves arguing not fighting but arguing unnecessarily it's normal, it's normal. which is normal i think this covid of a thing has really affected not just us everyone yeah it's affected many people you don't have a, you don't have your life to yourself again yeah. no normal life mask here and there Everyone and, um, is getting sweet at this point. We don't go out the way we used to. Yeah, like we used to go out of now. Now we can't do stuff. that. It's really stressful. And I feel bad for children born in the yeah. age. I feel bad for children around Kian's age. Because <coughs> back when we had Kingston, we used to move of out. Course. We used to go out a lot and all of that. But Because mentally, it's not good for neither adults or for the, for the children exactly. themselves. So. They need exactly. to go out, change air and all that, but since they're not getting that, it's, exactly. it's, not, it's not easy. It's not easy for anybody at all. We keep our fingers crossed, hoping for the best. Guys. Exactly, we just hope for the best, cause that's 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 the only option we have. We yeah, hope yeah. for the best. If you're a Muslim, please pray. If you're a Christian, pray. Pray, pray, pray. Why are you that's pointing? Why are you pointing at my people? You said I should quit YouTube. Now I'm doing YouTube video. You're not the one talking more than me. That I'm not actually to quit, babe. You said I should quit YouTube. You said listen, I should quit listen, YouTube. Listen, I said. You say quit YouTube no. if it's stressing you. There's, there's, <laughs> there's a difference between quitting and taking your time. Mm. I'm still taking time because it's really getting into you. You're putting yeah. in much work and the views yeah. are not coming. So especially her, doing vlogmas. I so told her, babe, I think I need to explain. I owe them an explanation as to what happened during vlogmas. Why I stopped with vlogmas. I, I was genuinely going to finish the 25 days of vlogmas. Mm. I stopped on the 10th day. And that was because something stupid happened. My videos were already ready. Remember mm. when the internet just stopped? Yeah. The whole of our. Our streets did not, nobody had for internet days. connection. Which two days? Nobody had internet connection for four days. That was bad. Nobody, like, they were doing some reconstruction on the roads and they, whatever they did actually affected the um, the cyber networks and, and everything. Could, no damages was paid. <laughs> no damages was paid. So, like, four days, I already had things piled up to do and all of that. So, I just lost the interest mm. and from there, I fell a bit ill and the rest is history so that was what happened with vlogmas so don't i'm not a lazy youtuber i was really putting i was really out to be consistent with vlogmas but that was what happened so now you guys understand what happened with vlogmas i think i've explained pretty much everything so now we're just going to continue from where we left off Welcome back to Bella Press TV. We'll try, we'll try to be consistent. Yeah, I will try to be consistent this time, as Hobby said. You know I will blow. Hey, Chineke, amen. <laughs> those people you're looking up to today, they started from somewhere. Yes, you know, exactly, so. exactly. There's always a beginning. Just keep digging. Keep digging. Yeah. Is it good? Keep oh, good. I'm a good digger. I'm a good digger. One day, one day, you dig out. I'll be digging the gold. Yeah, dig the gold. Yes, that's it. that's it for today, guys. And please, I'm... guys, please subscribe, okay. share, mm -hmm. and give us some thumbs up, you know? Yes. Yeah, Watch out for more videos. And if you have any video requests, you can leave it down below as exactly, well. Exactly, yeah. We'd we'll love to know. Yes, till next time guys, don't forget this year, my mantra for this year is Happy, Happy Vibes! vibes. So
when you hear me singing happy vibes or shouting happy vibes, don't be surprised. That's the mantra because I'm speaking it into existence. Amen. It's an affirmation Amen. that even when I have sad things going on, or even when you have sad things going on, you're still gonna you're still going to be exuding happy vibes. You bring out happy vibes everywhere. Like everyone around you is just gonna be bringing out happy vibes. And you do so too. That, that's what we need. You know, that's all we need in this in time because moment, things are really you know, bad. That's, that's what we need. Just be happy, be happy, be happy. It yeah. takes nothing to be happy. It takes, yeah, you know? it takes absolutely nothing to be yeah. happy. Even though it's just challenging, it's hard to say ha be happy. But yeah, exactly. For me, like this year, like I just, I was speaking to a friend and I was like, I need a mantra for my channel. And we just talk with happy vibes. So watch out for my next video, the next video we film. So, till next time, guys. We love you. We love you guys. Bye. Bye.